Greetings and welcome to this quick update. So this video is a reminder plus it contains useful information regarding the newly released iOS 18.1 and iOS 17.7.1. So guys, if you are on these versions, please right now downgrade to iOS 17.7 or iOS 18.0.1 on your supported devices because in the future good things are coming and in this video we will discuss the same so as you can see the security content for ios 18.1 it fixed a lot of bugs and issues and one of them is the mobile backup or as you know the sparse restore and the same is the case with ios 17.7.1 as you can see it right here you can see this post by a developer who recommends that please downgrade to ios 18.0.1 or lower or you can also downgrade to ios 18.1 beta 4 hopefully something interesting is going to happen also as you can see it right here as of 31st of october ios 18.1 beta 4 is also still signed you can see another post that using sparse restore it is possible to fix the three app limit and you will be able to install more than three apps also in the future if core trust bug number three happens you will be able to get a troll store so finally the good range is ios 15.2 through 17.7 including ios 18.1 through ios 18.1 beta 4 also as you can see here is the screenshot from the official kaubanga discord server you can see that yes nugget do work on ios 18.1 but if you want future nugget features you have to stay on iOS 18.0.1 or iOS 17.7 or iOS 18.1 beta 4. Moreover, if you stay on iOS 17.6 or iOS 17.5 or below, according to this post, more good things might come up in the future. So it is always best to stay on the lowest iOS version. Now, if you wish to downgrade your device, first of all, connect it to itunes via usb and make a backup of all the data then from ipsw.me you can simply select your device for example i have this ipad 7 and from there you can simply get the ipsw and then simply get it to your computer and on itunes for windows press and hold the shift key and if you are on mac press and hold the options key then left click restore then simply select the file then hit open then hit the restore button to downgrade after the process is complete you can restore the backup especially for your a11 and lower devices you can use blob saver to save your blobs so that you can downgrade in the future you can simply head to the official github page for blob saver it is completely free and then get to releases you can see it is available for mac os linux and windows simply install it and open it connect your device via usb and then hit read from device also on your a12 and higher devices you can simply specify app notes from here and it can also read it from device without a jailbreak then from there you can simply check all signed versions include betas you can also save it to shsh host or TSS saver then simply specify a location hit go and wait for the process to finish all right as you can see it save all the blobs for all the signed versions and you can see all the blobs saved here and I have checked they are all valid that's all for this update if I have more information I will definitely share it with you I will see you in a new video goodbye and take care